There are a lot of people out there struggling with pain and they can't figure out where it's coming from. Pain that's stopping them from enjoying their life. Pain that starts to identify who they are. Pain was designed as a signal to tell us to change something, not a way of life. It's really easy to get lost in the medical system, lost trying to figure out where your pain is coming from, spending a ton of money, and not really getting the answers you're looking for. An organ in good health has good movement. And in my experience as a physical therapist, organ movement is oftentimes the missing piece to someone fully recovering from their pain, injury, disease. Even if your pain doesn't seem linked to an organ, our entire body is connected. My name is Dr. Missy Albrecht. I'm a physical therapist and I truly believe that how we take care of our organs throughout the day matters. So I work with patients in the clinic and I'm always leaving them with self-care techniques so that they can carry the treatment on throughout the day. I created the Organ Healing Guide as a resource for really the world so that you can cruise through and learn different techniques to help start to shift your lifestyle and improve your organ health. So once you purchase the Organ Healing Guide, there's a lot of information in there, 14 different organs to cruise through. So what I did was created a questionnaire for you to fill out so that I can read through and give you recommendations on which organs I think you should start with. As you start looking through the organ healing guide, you're gonna to start to learn about things like essential oils to add to your diffuser to support your mood in the morning, to apply to certain areas of your body to support certain organs, and also to add things like lemon to your water to support a healthy system. Things like sitting in a deep squat while you sip on your coffee in the morning can not only help with healthy bowel movements, but it can also create a space for you to be able to work through emotions that may be stored in your organs by journaling affirmations and helping to reprocess your nervous system. We know that organs need to move to be healthy and we can start to improve their movement naturally through our breath and then we can also use tools like the Corgis Ball to do self-massage. We are creating space for the organs to move again, and there are many different techniques that we can use for each of the 14 organs. The goal of this guide is to get you back to doing the things you love to do without pain. You do not have to do all of these things every day, but you're gonna to start to learn what works for you, what doesn't work for you, and what changes with you as you change throughout your life. We all deserve to live a life without pain, to be able to enjoy what we're doing and enjoy the company of others around us. If you're ready to take your life back and try something that you've never tried before, the Oregon Healing Guide is for you.